is real life, nigga, fuck music Don't matter how I do it, I just do it Never think twice, bro, I just do it 23, 90, just do it This is real life, nigga, fuck music Yo, what's going on ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to the channel. We're over here playing Anime God Simulator, and I do believe there's a Okay, 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 it scared the crap out of me, bro. Anyway, as I was about to say, I do believe there is a one mil visits event, and the update log information just appeared on the screen, along with that freaking crazy sound that just turned on by itself. Anyway, it says here, one million visits sword, 0.05% chance any mob, Limited time, one mil star, three event champions, limited swords, buff, bug fixes, and much more. And there is also um, a game pass that is 25% off. I do believe that could be dual wielding or more damage. I'm not entirely sure. Let's click on buy just to see what it is. Okay, so it is the dual wielding game pass right now, 25% off, which is pretty damn good. But 449 Robux is still a lot at the same exact time. So it's kind of like, I don't know if that's... I don't know if that's that's legit good, but anytime you get a discounted price on something, you know, it, it makes sense to buy things. All right, so we're going to check those out, but check out my team right now. We got Legendary Piccolo, we got Epic Trunks, and then, of course, we got Mystical Perfect Cell right there. Oh, my God. Look at his aura effect. That is so cool, bro. Literally. One of the best things about games like this is when they can add the, you know, actualities to certain, you know, warriors, characters, fighters, et cetera, et cetera. So just having, you know, like Dragon Ball Z characters with aura effects is just it's just top notch. That's something that I would love to see in all, um, you know, anime games and stuff like that. Um, taking a look at their stats, though, if we go over here to champions. As you guys can see, this Piccolo right now, 315k on the damage. We got, uh, no, as a matter of fact, Piccolo is 135k on the damage. Cell over here is 315k on the damage. And then, of course, we got a bunch of trunks in here at 63k. So it's not bad. This is a decent team for my player progress uh, obviously there's going to be a lot of people that are better than me and you probably have better fighters and better you know whatever in your inventory but if you don't have this guy over here with the red outlining his profile picture you definitely need to farm some eggs um looking at my swords here we got a pretty decent sword this is an epic sword 240k on the damage i could do a whole lot better my inventory is starting to fill up right now but the good thing about that is whenever it does actually fill up, there is a multi-delete down here. So I can always delete something whenever I um, basically start to run out of space. So same as with your, um, you know, with your champion fighters here. All right. So now let's actually spin the wheel here and see what we can get. Um, yeah, there's a sword on here. I kind of want to get that. I don't know what it does, but... It does say OP sword. Okay, so we got five minutes of damage boost, which is, you know, it's good. It's not what I was expecting to get, but that's good. We're going to save that because, you know, when you activate a boost and you're not actually grinding the game, you're just wasting it. New limited sword right there. Ooh, that looks so beautiful in that purple, bro. All right. So where is the one mil event? Okay, it's all the way over here. Cool. Okay, so it's going to cost us 200k in yen. Wait, is that 200k? No, it's 2.5. Okay. It's kind of like like this person's champion, this person's fighter. Um it was kind of blocking the numbers right there and I couldn't see it. All right, so let's go ahead and buy. Let's see what we can get here. Okay, we got an epic the flamingo. So that's the first one. 
which is still good. He looks very epic. He has the one mil above his head. And these should definitely help out a lot of brand new players in the game. Like, I feel like these stats should be above what I have currently equipped. And we're going to find out, basically. All right. So if we get a couple of these, we can make them golden. Let's see. Where are they hitting on? 99K. So that's actually not bad. They're better than Goku. And they're better than Gohan, for sure. But they're not better than uh, Piccolo and uh, Perfect Cell. So that's to be expected, basically. All right, let's go over here. And let's make this uh, golden here. Let's see if we can do it at 63%. Ah, we failed. Okay. That's fine. We got plenty of yen. We can go ahead and get some more so to make 100 i think you need um at least like eight maybe so to have a full team you're going to be there for quite a while okay we got alish alish is the uh second one so that's the second the best one that you guys can get here 11.99 percent we're getting close we're getting very close if we would have had like an ultra lucky it would have been so much better bro Okay, it also says here to join our Discord for regular Game Pass and Sword giveaways. Oh, interesting. I'm actually a part of their Discord server, but the thing is, when I get notifications for, like, giveaways and stuff, it's always at the last second, you know? It's, it'll be like, I entered the giveaway, and then if I was announced as a winner or something like that, I wouldn't be able to know until, like, the next day, and it'll be, like, too late, you know? You had a certain time to claim it, and you weren't here, so... Someone else could have been picked. Not saying that I won anything recently, but I'm just pointing out the obvious. I don't know how Discord server um, notifications work out, you know? All right, so let's check out the stats of the second to best one here. Okay, so 200K. I like that. We're going to go ahead and unequip uh, Trunks here, and we're going to go ahead and equip... Alish, and we're also going to give Alish a weapon as well. So, um, this is currently equipped to Trunks, I believe. And all we got to do basically is just equip best, and then boom, they'll all have their swords. And I also wanted to show you guys another sword in here as well. So, look at this we got the Feather Sword. This is a mythical, and you know, mythical swords and secret swords are one of the hardest swords to get in a game. So the fact that I was able to get that, and it was my first mythical sword, it just meant everything to me. Um, but we also have the legendary other swords in here as well. We got the Gunby. I don't know how to pronounce this name, but I just call it the Gumby sword. <laughs> and it just looks really, really awesome. Like these swords, like the creations of them, they're not so basic looking. And I like the factor of that. You know what I'm saying? Because a lot of people could just create a regular sword. But a lot of these swords are customized to the anime themes. And they make a close representation of the swords that they actually use. And, you know, just seeing that is really, really dope. So, like, for example, like these kunais, you know what I'm saying? These are basic swords. Uh, katana, this is basic. Throwing star, the shurikens, these are basic swords. But then when you get up to swords like, you know, this legendary here or this rare here or even this mythical, it's just like, okay, I see what you've done there and I'm admiring it, you know? And then even these bow staffs here, like, <laughs> bow staffs are so basic, but... You can understand, like, why they made, you know, certain weapons. But look at the weapon. Look at that, bro. That is so dope. All right. So I'm fast as hell. <laughs> and we also have a mount. Look at this. We got a mount, and we made some progress. Oh, okay. So this... So this one mil star is pretty much almost everywhere, I believe. Let's go see. Because if they've done that, that means I don't have to stay in the first world. That means I can literally go anywhere and open this up, right? I mean, I'm hoping that I'm correct here. Um, over here, you got enchantments. So you can enchant your sword. 
and you need uh, scroll enchants. I'm not entirely sure how you get scroll enchants, but if you guys know, let me know in the comment section. Um, what is this over here? Oh, okay, so this is the quest for the mount. We already done that. Okay, so where are we? Over here, um, I'm not entirely sure if you guys noticed, but down here, they made it like a little obby, which is kind of weird. But if you touch the water and stuff like that, you die. So you got to land on top of those boats just to get that chest that's all the way over there. Is it really worth it sometimes to get the chest? You know, yeah, I would say it is. And then you just find your way back up over here and you just jump up. Simple as that. So I'm not seeing the one mil star. Okay, here it is. No, um, this is not. Wait, where is it? Okay, it's over here. So yeah, it's almost in every world, which is good. You know, like I said, once again, that means you won't have to travel back to the first world just to open it up. And as you guys know, um, this is my favorite world right here. The DBZ world. <laughs> this is my favorite world right here. So we got... We got booze everywhere. We got quests coming from Goku himself. That is really, really cool. Then, of course, you got your uh, player upgrades over here, which is going to cost you a lot of yen every time you uh, go to a different zone. And then going up here, we have Frieza. And then going all the way up to the top, we have the next world, which is going to cost me three billion. So we got a lot to grind. And we also have a lot of work to put in right now because we got freaking Broly's to battle up here and we also have Jiren up here as the boss this guy lot of power man if you guys have ever seen the most recent episodes of like DBZ you know uh Jiren he is up there with Goku and matches of like strength speed durability and just overall power level he is just a fantastic fighter and the fact of the matter is that these guys are actually just fighters and not gods of destruction or, you know, angels or anything like that. It's pretty damn impressive to be that strong. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. You know, this is where I left off. And uh, I'm going to be grinding this one mil egg. Hopefully we can get the uh, legendary 0.01% chance. And I'm hoping that we can make it in enough time to... Um, you know, make it to the next area and start catching up to some of the pros in the game. If you guys have enjoyed this video, be sure to smash the like button on it. And don't forget, subscribe to the channel right now. If you guys are new here watching for the very first time, he shout out to Drake Craft. Go ahead and follow my friend. He is a YouTuber. He has more subs than me. And I am uh, recommending that you go ahead and check out his channel because he covers a lot of anime content related games. So if you guys are strongly into anime, you know, why not subscribe to one of my friends that is a YouTuber and that covers it? I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace. Hey, yo, what the fuck? That was totally wicked. Better how I do what I just do. I'm my mama proud of me. I hope my mama proud of me. Because I dubbed college just so I could focus on a dream. Uh, I know my mama died of me. Salute me, nasty down with me. Now two bros going back and forth. Sibling rivalry. Uh, who this guy gotta be? Do numbers like the lottery. The cold. Every winter, every summer, nothing hot as me And if I spring up, build my nigga on the side of me Ready for a war?